As an environmental science teacher, I talk a lot to my students about ecosystems and all of the different parts of an ecosystem. And we spend a lot of time talking about why everything in the ecosystem is important. A general rule is, if it's in nature, it's there for a reason. Every year I have at least one student who says, but what about mosquitoes? Well, even mosquitoes have a place in nature. Hi, I'm Janice Crinetti. I've been teaching environmental science for over 20 years, and I'm here to talk to you today about some of the habitats mosquitoes can be found in. Now, insects are very, uh, very strong evolutionarily. They exist all over the world. In fact, we find them pretty much everywhere except Antarctica. It's just too cold for them to survive, and there doesn't tend to be a lot of actual liquid water. It's all frozen in the ice. You ever seen March of the Penguins? Mosquitoes just can't survive there. But mosquitoes are very dependent on water. You see, mosquitoes, as most insects, go through a process that's called complete metamorphosis. It's their life cycle, from egg to larva to pupa to adult. You're probably familiar with this concept where butterflies are concerned. The difference between mosquitoes and butterflies is that mosquito larvae are aquatic insects. They have to be in the water. They can't survive out on land. So if you find a mosquito, it's going to be close to water. Now, mosquitoes are very, very common in areas where it's warm and moist. Uh, think about Africa, where the malaria is such a problem. But even now, we start to see mosquitoes in colder environments, mountaintops. They're not as common, and they're not as populated, but they can exist anywhere there is some kind of fresh water in which they can lay their eggs. So chances are, if you're around water, you're also going to be around mosquitoes. It's the good news, bad news. I'm Janice Crenetti, and this is What Are Some Mosquito Habitats?